With this being a Game 3 set, I figured that we'd go ahead and throw commentary back on. Hello everyone, it's Brave here. And, um, I got one thing to say right now. Charizard, he, he definitely lives long. Well, you know, there's that, and then there's also the fact that, uh, Daisy just can't kill. But wow, all of Noku's Pokemon are just coming out to play today. All three of them in full force. I w I've been on like the edge of my seat this whole time. I had to come sit down, see what was going to happen. But of course, no character switches will be happening. We're jumping right back into, I'm pretty sure, Battlefield. And that pick must have been by Noku. Um, if anything, it's, oh, it's looking like small Battlefield. So, you know, just a little bit of a different environment. But regardless, a strong start from blank this time. One that we're not used to seeing these past two games. But here we go. Let's see how long he can keep up those up air strings. Not too long. Oh, actually, I stand corrected. That's four in a row. And if we just... Wow. I wouldn't think that would confirm at this percent, but, you know, Daisy's a weird character with her floatiness and everything. And I don't mean her floats, but wow. Another uppy off the ground, too. I mean, I can't, you know, tell you off the top of my head what frame that is, but wow. I mean, of all characters right now, we were seeing a fantastic ledge trap from Squirtle. Now, out of all the Pokemon, there we go. There's, there's the Ivysaur. Now, if we think, you know, Ledge Trap, that's when Ivysaur is going to come out to play, but not right now. Of course, oh, wow, okay, so Charizard is out early, which is actually surprising to me, but wow, I'd like to see Blank actually get any kills. I mean, you know, actually, for what it's worth, he's going to do fantastic with the Ledge Trapping here. Wait. Oh, I spoke a little too soon. Wow! No DI there, looking really ugly for a second. Oh, the parasol cancel set it all. That was actually incredible. Avoiding the up smash narrowly. Now he goes for, okay, so, you know, the fact that turnip hit was interesting because for the rest of this set, we've seen it pretty much clank, and that is not the ideal DI for getting hit by dash attack, but it is what it is. That back air comes out of nowhere, but, you know, giving them some nice free percent. Daisy takes everything that she can get. I am, sir, again, the ledge trapping from Squirtle, barely missing the upbeat. I'm not sure if that's SDI or just unlucky. You know, multi-hits, smash ultimate, it's the game we're playing. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Squirtle f -tell. He He really does do it all. And, but there we go. An upbeat, not killing, though. Interesting. You know, like, I, I, we, we can see it. Wow. Again, none of these moves killing. This is quite the reversal from what we've seen from the past set of Blank pretty much being uh, struggling to kill, you know, all of his Pokemon. But now here we go, Ivysaur with the kill throw. I believe he, uh, I was going to say he's the, he's the Pokemon with the kill throws. Absolutely not. We have Charizard in the mix. But right now, we're actually doing a fantastic job once again with the ledge traps from Blank. Narrowly missing that turn up, actually not really at all because, you know, I oh, that's another just great upbeat cancel from Ivysaur, but he's got to switch it up soon. He's running low. Actually, wait, could it be time for Charizard? Yes, it is. What a beautiful switch, too. Absolutely not something I expected to see right now. Oh, here we go. Now, you know, we blank using that frame two jab, by the way to box out Charizard and successfully secure another kill with the ledge trap. And right now, we have more up air, uh, actually I thought he was gonna go for an up air string, but he went right for the up B. Ivysaur down air, fantastic, not beating out that recovery. Not as long as that parasol is around. So disjointed, so good, and Blank using it immaculately to the point where, oh, he's gonna go for it again? Yeah, he got it that time. All right, he's got his turn up on deck, but he's not at all able to ledge trap right now. Oh, here we go. He's getting a very good job getting him in, in the corner. We're seeing a lot of Ivysaur right now. All right, Charizard has come out to play. This is the final stand right now. If that was an upbeat, I'm pretty sure that was the end of the game. But otherwise, very nice up air juggles from blank. Right now, we have Charizard making his final stand. It's ledge trap time, and that F tilt was just a little too late, but it's time for the up throw. That didn't kill. You know, with the logo in the way, I had to wait a second. I'm like, did that do anything? It didn't. Wow, the reversal getting onto the... Wow! <laughs> like, that, that was reversal back to back. No one could have really seen that one coming. But right now, okay. Quick spot dodge. Wow, Charizard is in the corner fighting for his life, but Noku's doing so fantastic at boxing him out right now. 
Oh, just a little bit more delay on that. Jab three would have finished it out. But with no real causation, we cannot have... Never mind, we're all good. All right. The ledge trap has once again been... Rever oh, wow. Both players fighting for control of center stage. A very nice poke from Noku. Game is getting worrying. That was no DI, but it didn't... Oh, and then the tech. Oh, he's teching for his life. But does it matter? He grabs it again. Incredible. And he misses the F tilt, but it doesn't matter. The Nair is going to close it out, killing from all directions, firing on all cylinders. It's Daisy. Fantastic job, Blank. And now, I'd be lying if I said I know who's next, but it looks like it's...